Hi, I'm Mo Allen, and welcome to part three of our AV booth badging course. Today I'll be showing you how to make your first recording in Audacity. Audacity is a great starter digital audio workstation, which you can install for free on your home computer. When you open Audacity, the first thing you'll want to do is make sure the input and output settings are correct. For the studio computer, you'll be using the following settings. Input, Focusrite Thunderbolt. One mono recording channel and output, Focusrite Thunderbolt. By having the input and output set to the Focusrite audio interface, you're telling the interface to send sound to the computer and the computer to channel playback through the audio interface's headphone and speakers. Make sure you're set to mono during your recording session. Stereo recording uses two or more inputs to record a sound, while mono uses one microphone to record a single channel. If you're using the laptop to record with the Yeti mic, make sure to switch your input and output over to the Yeti mic. Once you've made sure your settings are correct, you can start recording. Press the red record button to begin recording and enter the AV booth. After you're done recording, come back to the computer and press stop. To listen to your recorded track, press play or spacebar. If you'd like to delete part of your recording, make sure the selection tool is selected and then click and drag to highlight a section of the track. After you've highlighted your selection, press the delete button on the keyboard. To quickly split your track into multiple clips, press Ctrl I on the keyboard. To move your clips around a track, select the time shift tool and then drag your track to the desired time spot. You can record on multiple tracks in Audacity. To add a track, you must go to the top and click Tracks, then add New, then Mono Track. You can also add a track by dragging and dropping an audio file directly into Audacity. The final step is exporting your track. Click on File in the top left corner and then find the Export button. You can then export to MP3 or WAV. You also can export audio which will open additional export options and file types. Lastly, you can export multiple which will export your tracks as separate files for later use. In addition to Audacity, Ideaspace also offers access to Adobe Audition and FL Studio 10. Adobe Audition is a step up from Audacity and offers enhanced tools for mixing and editing tracks. FL Studio is loaded with easy to use tools for beat making but you can record audio with it as well. We have the all plugin edition of FL Studio. Feel free to also search through our plugins like Pitcher to give your voice the enhancement you're searching for. Congratulations, you've now earned the AV Booth badge. You can now reserve the AV Booth after you've demonstrated your knowledge to a staff member. See you next time.